Hello, my name is Rachel Eddowes. I'm from Virginia Beach, Virginia, which is Tidewater Council. And um, well, to start off with my scouting career, I started as a little daisy in Girl Scouts and pretty much went up all the way through Ambassadors and ended up earning my Girl Scout Gold Award. But in between there, when I was 14, I joined the Venturing Program. And initially, the first two years, I was very reluctant to join the program since I didn't really see the value, I didn't see the point, I wasn't having much fun. But my sophomore year in high school, my crew planned a scuba diving trip down to the Florida Keys. And scuba diving was something I'd always wanted to do since I was in kindergarten. And so to jump into the water like, and just be in full um, scuba uniform, you could say, and just swim around with the fish, like that just blew my mind away. And immediately I was hooked. I wanted to keep doing, I wanted to keep doing adventures and stuff like that. And so I ended up planning another scuba diving trip on my own for my crew. And later on, my crew did a hiking trip in Colorado um, just exploring the different Rocky Mountains that there were there. Initially, I did not join venturing for any type of awards or anything like that. I didn't really care for them, but so my sophomore year in high school, my advisor held a ceremony for the entire crew and said, hey, guess what? Based on what you guys were already doing, you earned these bronze awards and your gold award. And I was like, really? I didn't plan any of this. I didn't do anything. And so it turned out that he had coordinated everything behind our backs and <laughs> essentially we earned these without even realizing it. And so it's like, okay, I see what you're doing there. And so from there I went on to earn my silver award, my ranger award, my quest, and my trust award. Um, also in venturing, um, I was asked to serve on the National Youth Leadership Training Staff for my council the first year it was open up for venturers. And I fell in love. I didn't think I had any leadership skills before then, but serving on staff, interacting with my team, and just realizing that I do have it in me, I came back two more times and ended up serving as course leader for my, for my council. Um, I eventually came out here to the National Advanced Youth Leadership Experience here at Philmont Scout Ranch and um, staffed that four times, ending up as senior crew leader last summer. Um, this past March, I went to the Florida Sea Base and served the pilot course that was there. In addition to all this leadership training, I did two Kodiaks, and then I also served on the pilot Inter-American Leadership Training course that happened this past December in Houston. Um, this was for the Inter-American region of WASM, and so we had two scouts from every country between Canada and Chile come to Houston for this week-long training course, and it blew my mind away. Like, I don't think I'm, I still have been able to process the fact that I was in, a, in one room with that many countries represented. It, it was so cool, like scouting from around the world. Um, I, uh, Staffed the National Jamboree in 2013. I staffed the zip lines. That was something I had never done before. I had never zip lined before, so I wanted to staff the zip lines. Uh, in no February of 2013, I represented the venturing program at the Report to the Nation. So with the rest of the delegation, I went around Washington, D.C., meeting different dignitaries. Uh, we went to the Pentagon, we went to the Capitol, we went to the Supreme Court, we went to the Goddard Space Center, and then later on in December that year, we got to meet the President of the United States in the White House. So that was really cool. I'm very honored. Uh, this, uh, this August, I will be representing the Boy Scouts of America again at the World Scout Conference and the World Scout Youth Forum in Slovenia. This is a conference that happens every three years, and there are only five of us going, and so I'm really excited to represent not just venturing, but the Boy Scouts of America there. I'm currently, I'm 20 years old. I attend George Mason University outside of Washington, D.C. I am majoring in communications and conflict analysis and resolution. The reason I chose these majors is because I think, that, I think of these as very valuable skills that you can have in any situation, and that partly became through my experience with the leadership training. I don't necessarily know what I want to be when I grow up yet, but I know I want to continue with the leadership training and training others.